Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. So today's video, as you can see, got Donovan's Ferrari F430 here in the garage again. And this thing looks absolutely insane. So if you're new here, I actually have a wrap company, Apex Solutions. And, and that is my Lexus right there that's wrapped with that crazy epic design. Uh, it's a whole lot of but that's not what we're here for. We're here for Donovan's Ferrari F430. He dropped it off last night so I could do a little bit more vinyl work on it. As you can see, these amazing looking stripes look like Scuderia stripes, which I actually did. And they look absolutely phenomenal. Go right to the body line. And that just looks so good on the front end. As you can see, it comes all the way down to that tip right there. What I'm gonna be working on today is a little bit of accents. We're gonna try to make some of the, kind of break up a lot of this just solid red. There's just a lot of red on this car. He did get these really nice black wheels, which looks absolutely insane. But he wants to do a little bit of accents like near this front vent. So we're gonna see if we can add a little bit of gloss black kind of in that vent. And these are kind of like a gunmetal gray. We're gonna try to black those out as well. And then some accents back here on the back end and kind of like go with this body line a little bit and then kind of fill in this area behind the license plate but i think it's gonna look absolutely amazing it's gonna break up a lot of that just big solid red especially with these on the back it's gonna look really good with that epic diffuser there in the back so i'm just gonna go ahead and skip a lot of the boring stuff i'm just gonna go ahead and get started on wrapping and we'll see how this turns out all right guys so the ferrari is done with all the accents i did which you can see one of them right there and then I'll also kind of walk around and show you guys some of the other stuff i did to it but this thing looks absolutely insane and to donovan who has all these crazy awesome ideas with his cars thank you so much for like allowing me the opportunity to be able to make them happen especially something like that it doesn't look like much but in a way it like really enhances the car it makes it a super unique one of a kind nobody else will have a car that looks just like this and it looks absolutely amazing so let's go ahead and check it out Alright guys, so other than like doing these little accents right here, I actually did these in the same gloss black. It was like a gunmetal kind of painted area as well as like obviously the mesh grill. So that is all gloss black all the way up and around inside there. Like I said, those on each side. And then when you come around to the back, we got this trim piece up here by this rear kind of mesh area. And it just looks really good. It really breaks up a lot of that red, but then also this entire area behind the license plate and then kind of up on the underside of that, which looks absolutely amazing. And then when you step back, it really kind of like it breaks up all the red and kind of gives it like a really good contrast with the red and black and looks absolutely amazing. But I have another really big wrap coming up. It's going to be a Jaguar F type. It's going to be super awesome, but let's go ahead and skip forward to the Jaguar being in the garage. So just like that, uh, that's not a Jaguar F-Type, but let's go ahead and check it out. All right, so this is not the Jaguar F-Type that's actually supposed to be here, um, but we'll go ahead and add a little bit of vinyl to this. Uh, pretty nice golf. I love these wheels. They look absolutely incredible. And we will go ahead and let's see, it's still a windshield banner on this car. It's looking a little plain. You gotta hide the little spot where the mirror is. So let's just go ahead and add like a white strip right there. And it's gonna look absolutely amazing. Gosh, got some like ghost decals right down there. This thing looks pretty awesome, especially with that crazy mirror tint. But let's go ahead and uh, do a windshield banner. All right, and there it is. A nice good windshield banner to go across the top there with kind of like a cut out decal, which looks really cool. So then like on the inside, you can actually see right through it. But that looks absolutely amazing on this awesome Volkswagen Golf. Like this looks so cool. But yeah, now let's see if we can try to get that Jaguar F-Type to show up because obviously it's nowhere to be found. So, so let's try this again. All right. And, and there it is. Jaguar F-Type. Oh, where's my hair? Um, all right. Well, uh, we're about that later, but anyway, Jaguar F-Type is here in the garage about to get wrapped. It's going to look absolutely insane. So let's go ahead and do like a little walk around real quick. Check out this Jaguar before I start getting into the wrap. All right, so this Jaguar F-Type is the best color for a car to wrap. Black cars are always the absolute best because whenever you look in any like the crevices, door jams, and all that kind of stuff, you never really see it. But 
this is a beautiful spec Jaguar F Type R, and it looks so nice. Especially you got a couple nice vents right up front. You got some hood vents here, which look really good. If you didn't know, the hoods actually open in reverse on the F Types, which this looks absolutely amazing. And it's kind of like an R8, where like the front fender kind of it's not the whole fender but part of the fender actually opens up with the hood which is really special on this car it looks super awesome but we're gonna go ahead and walk around as you can see it's a convertible which is really nice it does have this little spoiler that pops up so i'm going to go ahead and wrap that as well as everything else and then i'm going to make these badges black we got some uh super wrap we're going to hit those with and it's going to look like a nice gloss black finish on top of the white vinyl that's going on but also we're going to kind of leave the diffuser black so it's going to have a really good contrast didn't really say what vinyl we're going to be using but it says 3m i think it's like flip ghost white i don't know if you can really see that but it's like a satin white and it has like that kind of rainbow pearlescent kind of look to it so that's going to look absolutely amazing like right there you can kind of see some like that rainbow glare it's going to look so good on this jaguar especially with the black roof she did say it is going to get black wheels here in the near future, so that's going to look absolutely insane with the rest of this wrap. Going to black out the chrome around the grill, as well as these little badges right here, these little kind of vent trim pieces, whatever you're going to call those. But this car is going to look absolutely insane when it's done. So let's go ahead and get started. I am going to skip through a lot of this process because wrapping is a very long, tedious process, and filming the entire thing will take up so much time. But I will check up with you guys periodically. I'll show you guys like a little progress of how it's going along the way. But like I said, this thing looks absolutely amazing as it is. But I cannot wait to see it with the vinyl on. So let's go ahead and get started. So the hood is done, which looks absolutely amazing. We have the black vents here to kind of give it that really cool contrast. It looks like a nice satin white, but it's actually um, kind of like an iridescent type. I don't know if you can really see it on the hood with all the lights up above. I'm going to go over to the like trunk lid. Let me see, because I also have the rear bumper done as well, which looks so good. Let me turn off the main overhead lights, and maybe in the reflection, you can kind of see some of that. There it is. You can see like that rainbow kind of effect there. It looks absolutely incredible. And once it's on the entire car, that's going to look so, so good. Like I said, the rear bumper's done, part of the trunk lid, and then got the giant hood there all done. But yeah, this is going to look absolutely amazing when it's done, and I cannot wait to show you guys. But something did come in for this wall. So I do have the vinyl rack that came in, and it's going to go on this entire wall right here. So it's probably going to go almost to the floor, all the way up just past these tracks. It's going to be huge. It's going to be able to hold 12 rolls of vinyl. But sitting right over here, it actually did come in yesterday. I did open up this one to make sure that it was the correct thing that I ordered. Uh, two of the exact same ones. But once this Jaguar F-Type is done, I'm going to go ahead and work on that. I'm going to have to do some reinforcements on the wall before I can mount it up. Kind of like what I had to do here on the garage door opener with the 2x4. So I'm going to have to put some like brackets to go across the bolt into the studs. And then I'll be able to mount the uh, vinyl rack on. So that's going to be a pretty cool video. So nice and convenient to have all that on the big blank wall. And then I'm probably going to put my company logo like right there on the wall next to it. So it's going to look super cool. But I'm going to go ahead and get back to working on this car. And I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. Something that I do that I don't think anybody else does is I actually include a kind of wrap care bundle. And it's pretty much going to be the supplies to take care of your wrap for like the first little while. And then you can go to like Detail Garage, pick up more supplies for like the long term. But I always include like a few things so at least for a handful of months, the customers can actually take care of their car, use the right products on their vinyl and kind of start getting like a rhythm. They don't have to worry about running out somewhere right away. Like I just already include it for free and it's in the kind of bundle package whenever you uh, get a full wrap done by me. But let me show you guys what I include. So to start off with, I got a Chemical Guys bucket. There's a bunch of different colors and I always try to like match the bucket with the car. But in this case, it's gonna be this black bucket with a smoked. Um, but then I have a uh, wash mitt, also Chemical Guys. Like all this stuff's Chemical Guys. But a nice wash mitt, which is really awesome. It's gonna be really soft. So you're not gonna scratch up that vinyl. Uh, if it's gloss, I use Hydro Suds, which is a ceramic car wash, as well as wrap detailer. And what this does is it really like gives it like a good UV barrier as well as like enhance the gloss, the shine. And then you're going to be able to have like all that water repellent properties. So the vinyl is going to be very well taken care of with both of these. 
But if it's a matte wrap, I actually include this uh, meticulous matte wash, which is very similar. It's just a car wash, but it was made to give like the satin and matte um kind of like that matte finish because you don't want to be putting like a bunch of like high gloss stuff on matte products but then also here's a kind of like a detail spray so you can kind of like spray and wipe and whatnot so this is kind of the equivalent of the wrap detailer and then obviously the car wash is very similar to uh hydro suds but for obviously matte finishes and then i have a few microfibers here so this right here is just like a little little care kit so you can kind of see like whenever you do get like a full wrap but yeah like for me a lot of people they don't know exactly how to take care of vinyl right away and like one of the first things i like to explain is like how to take care of your vinyl don't do certain things or don't just run it through a random car wash uh but i do like to include this little care bundle just so that the customer can have like the tools required to be able to take care of their vinyl from like day one up until i, I don't know how long it's gonna last depending on how much they wash their car maybe like a few months who knows but still I like to have at least some kind of a means of uh, allowing people to be able to take care of their nicely fresh full wrap all right guys so i didn't really film the actual wrap process itself because i didn't want to waste too much time i wanted to be able to kind of get into the groove get working on this not have to sit and like keep recording stuff or try to set up the camera to get certain angles and whatnot i just wanted to go ahead and get this thing done but it is done and it looks absolutely amazing but here it is But I'm gonna go ahead and open the garage door, back it into the driveway. We're gonna get some really cool, awesome shots of it like out in the sun. See it in the daylight, especially with the cool color effect that it does because it looks absolutely amazing. All right guys, so this Jaguar looks absolutely insane, especially under the sun. Like it looks so beautiful. It's like that satin white pearl. And they also have like that ghost flip color, which is like that rainbow effect. And like I said, under this direct sun looks absolutely phenomenal. You can definitely see it a lot on the hood, which I really absolutely love. And I just can't get enough of saying that because this thing looks so, so good. But let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about this and I don't know, maybe like another car you want to see like this because I think this wrap looks absolutely amazing and I'm pretty sure the customers definitely will love this for sure. All right guys, so the owners are on their way to pick up the Jaguar F-Type, but next I'm going to be working on a vinyl rack. It's going to be right here on this wall. I'm super excited to do this. I have to check to make sure I have enough wood because I do need uh, at least four two by fours. I'm going to have to run them across and connect them, like drill them into the studs, and then I can then bolt the brackets onto those. But it's gonna look absolutely amazing. But like I said before, this car looks absolutely stunning, especially under the sun. And that crazy kind of rainbow effect looks so, so good. Like I just can't get over that. Like this is like one of the coolest vinyls I've ever used on a car. Like I would love to see somebody want to do something like this, but then with some other kind of camo or something crazy on top of this, because this looks absolutely stunning. All right, so I just checked and I actually do not have enough wood I need to be able to do the vinyl rack today, which is pretty disappointing because I was actually hoping to get a good head start on that. Be able to at least mount those boards and then get all those painted to be able to match like the same color as the wall. So you don't really see them on the backside of the vinyl rack. But I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video right here. I will just kind of do that off camera, maybe like later or tomorrow or something like that. I don't even know when. But if you guys like this video, definitely go down and hit that like button down below. Also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more kind of vehicle wraps or other crazy awesome car content especially the wraps recently have been picking up but definitely go check those out i do have an instagram and tiktok so down in the description down below you'll see those but like subscribe and as always thank you for watching